A new report shows some impressive specifications for the 5G Galaxy S10X and a very hefty price tag. We get more credible renders of the triple cameras of the iPhone 11, could we call. And if you have a Galaxy S9 or Galaxy S9 Plus, finally, believe it or not, Android Pie is rolling out. I'm Jaime Rivera, and you know, for as much as Diego makes fun of me for not having great jokes on the daily, guess how many jokes he's had in the past week? None. This is Pocket Now Daily, sponsored by Swappa. The official news today begin with deals both on Amazon and on B&H. You guys know how much I love the 11-inch iPad Pro. And if you're in the market for either model, they're currently $100 off. And there are some tax credit benefits also available in cases like B&H or free shipping, for example. You can learn more in the description. Now, let's talk about the Motorola Razr lineup. Yes, I know that's one of the most iconic cell phones ever, but we hear that there is something coming back to Verizon, that it's going to be a limited edition that could cost up to $1,500. And we're just trying to understand when they rumor a foldable device, what we're getting here. Is it truly a clamshell cell phone from back in the day or what the plans are? Stay tuned. And for those of you that are rocking a Samsung Galaxy S9 or S9 Plus, yes, Android Pie and the One UI has finally rolled out officially in the United States. I actually can't wait to fly back and just try it out on my own because uh, I owe you an After the Buzz episode, wait for it, but it definitely has everything to do with the software update as uh, Samsung finally pushes it out before they're unpacked. And before we talk more Galaxy, how about if we talk of iPhone 11? Uh, we've got some renders from the typical sources that uh, have proven to be quite credible, but I think we're kind of too early for this. I'm gonna call them a concept. You can let me know in the comments what you think, but uh, we see the camera hump in the middle with the triple cameras. Think about it as Apple has never done a camera in the middle, so that's the reason why I don't believe these renders are true, and yet uh, Cupertino has surprised us in the past. So let us know what you think about them. I, I don't know, man. It looks like an iPhone 10 with a hump in the middle. That's pretty much it for me. And finally, the hottest news today have to do with the Samsung Galaxy S10X, and don't quote me on that X. Uh, they used it. Uh, Samsung has shown us ugly names in the past, but uh, they're rumoring that the X has to do with the 10th anniversary of the Galaxy S10. Uh, I believe it's just probably a code name, but anyways, $1,400 to $1,500, Qualcomm Snapdragon 855, all the RAM, storage, and the rest of the specifications you want, and we hear 5G capabilities. It's just, you know, the price tag is kind of crazy. Let us know in the comments down below. I mean, what do you think? The rumors are that it could be a Korea exclusive initially, but would you be willing to pay that amount for a limited edition phone? I mean, I love the way OnePlus does it. 700 bucks and you get a lot of bells and whistles. Why charge more than that? And folks, before we end this video, we would love to thank our sponsor Swappa for making today's content possible. We are getting close to the launch of the Galaxy S10. We're expecting it to be a huge upgrade. So prepare your wallet by selling your old Samsung phone for the most money possible on Swappa. Follow the link in the description below to learn more. Friends, again, if you want to get the news earlier, follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to both our channels, English and Spanish, for more videos like this one. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I'm Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow from a different location.